So uh, this is, M Malia is going off to college, and uh, that's got to be. That's hard. Yes. Yeah. That's got to be. It, 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 look, as Michelle reminds me, our job is to prepare them not to need us. And both my daughters are wonderful people, and Malia is more than ready to leave. But I'm not ready for her to leave. And yeah, I was asked if uh, I would speak at her graduation. I said, absolutely not. Because I'm going to be sitting there with dark glasses, <laughs> sobbing. Uh, yeah, she's one of my best friends. And it's, it's going to be hard for, uh, for me not to have her around all the time. Uh, but she's ready to go. It, you, know, you, you can tell when they're, she's just a really smart, capable person. And she's, she's uh, ready to make her own way. And they're, wow. and they're, wonderf they're, they're wonderful girls. And I, um, Michelle gets all the credit, maybe an assist from my mother-in-law. But they really are just solid kids. They, you know, they don't have an attitude. They're courteous and kind to everybody. Um, you know, they work hard. They don't feel like they're entitled to anything. Uh, well, they have great parents. Yeah, uh, you, both you and Michelle are, are really, really amazing. Michelle is such a strong, wonderful role model yeah. for all women. And, I, and you know, she has been a great first lady. I, She's I agree. Been that I agree with. <laughs> that. We have to take another break. That is indisputable. Yep. yep. And you have been a great president. And like you said, people can say things over and over and over again about unemployment or the economy or anything else they can. But if, if you really, if you listen to that, you, you're going to believe it. If you look at and, and look into it and see what the facts are, it's just not the truth. We're better off now than we were when I came in. You've There's done no an doubt. amazing job.